Hi everyone, I am Prasun, team leader, Bone Connection Helmet. My team members are Manjunath Yu, technical lead, Nishit Rati, operational lead, and Prasanna Kumar, marketing lead, and faculty, mem- faculty mentor, Mrs. Teshwani S, assistant professor, BMSIT. Hi everyone, my name is Manjunath, or technical lead, Bone Conduction Helmet. Bone Conduction is the conduction of sound through to the inner ear, through the sculpture of the bone. Bone Conduction can be used by persons who are partially impaired and also normal person. Here we are using a helmet. This helmet is integrated with a 5G accelerometer. So whenever a person is met with an accident, something called as jerk ratio. That jerk ratio as will be crossing the limit. So that sends signal to the nearby phone to, via Bluetooth. And that's uh, in, inside the phone, we have been built software which sends a signal, SOS signal to the ambulance at our near police station so that the person who's met in an accident can be shared with this. Hi everyone, I'm Tejishwini from BMSIT, faculty mentor of Bone Conduction Helmet Project. In this project, we are developing a bone conduction helmet wherein the bone conduction transducer is incorporated in the helmet for assisting partially impaired or healthy persons. This will help the person who meet with an accident and will help them for saving their lives on time. The TI parts we are using a microcontroller TMS320 and a microcontroller TC1352P and a power amplifier TPA2026D2 and a DAC TLV320AIC which is a Class D power amplifier and the non-TI parts we are using a 1 into 8 ohm bone, bone conductive transducer, a microphone, a full face helmet, a GPS model and a GSM model. Nan Dinike, Nur in the Nure Kilometer by Baikal or Dini, Baikil and Urada Kagala, Baikan Mele, Helmet Lebeku, Helmet Lu Urada Kagala, other Ivot Nan in Gelterado, E. Helmet, Andre, Bone Condition Element on the Dinide, Bada of Karevagida, either in the Bada Projanide, Yauriti Indre, Narmalagi, Yadon Helmet account on full cover of the Wargad in the Matar of the Yaru, Yenu Kelsala, Adre, E. Element in the Namage. In the Boro Yare on the Sunna on Sabdano, Clear Kilsate, Webito, Clear Agi, Laru Kilsate, Mille Dagi, now Nirjana Prish to Water Tattoo, Ratakan Tay, Anirin Tay Water Tattoo, but just Taitri Bidobodu, Ilandre, Adel Bidu Bidobodu, Aga, Kapaka Yarila, Amnes for Modi Yelake, but Adre, E. Elemental Adra Atundaga, Immediate Yaliro, Namiro location, Athaliro, Amnes came, Mrs. Ogote, with locations here Agi. Adrin the Jiva Payan to Iradilla, Jibano Janato, E. Element to Bada Ukariagide, Idena Nanerla, and a Snaitrige, and a purchase of Yellow Wheel Tadini, New World Tadini, Bone Condes Element Akoli, Jiva Wolfoli, Chenagiri. Hello everyone, this is Nishatrati. I am the business and operations lead of this group. I am going to explain you about the operations required to take this business to the next level. So I will t- tell you a brief about my group. Uh, this is Prasun as team leader. This is Manjunath Yu as the technical lead uh, and me Nishit Rati as the business analyst and Prasanna Kumar as the marketing lead and uh, Mrs. Tejaswini S as a faculty mentor for this project. In the developing countries like India, where road transportation is one of the most important means of transportation, head injuries are a leading cause of death from motorcycle crashes with many deaths occurring despite optimal use of the available treatment facilities. As after wearing a full face helmet, it becomes difficult for a person to keep track of its surrounding as a person cannot hear properly as a hearing ability reduces due to the full coverage of the face and it becomes difficult for him to react on a horn given by passing by vehicles. And it is also seen in India that public abounding road accident victims. So the solution for this problem will be like bone conduction allows us to hear sound through the vibration of the bones of our face. This means that the sound waves are bypassing the outer and the middle ear and directly stimulating over the inner ear. Incorporating SOS to the helmet which may alert the emergency services in case of an accident. Hi everyone, my name is Prasanna Kumar. I'm the marketing lead. And when it comes to product pricing, our total cost is about 9,800. And uh, uh, it's distributed into uh, manufacturing cost that is about 6,000 which includes raw materials, processing and fabrication. And product uh, packaging cost is uh, about 1000 which includes uh, delivery, assembly and manufacturing. And delivery cost is about 7000 which is uh, shipping package. And uh, 7000 which is multiplied by 0.4 would be 2800. Distributors discount would be about 60% and uh, total would come about 9800. Including profit suggested, retail price is 9800. 
important differentiation. There is no company in India which makes con bone conduction helmet. But if we see in the global market, there are some startups who makes bone conduction helmet for bicycles. A product contains a SOA system and it is for a full face helmet for power two wheels. The differentiation would be variable to the customers as it will help partially deaf people to drive two wheelers in Indian traffic conditions. It will also help to reduce the accident related death because of SOS integration with the helmet which will help the accident victims to reach hospitals online. It will also help to reduce the accident related death because of the SOS integration with the helmet which will help the accident victims to reach the hospitals on time. The helmets available in the market are quite heavy as well. So the helmet which we are going to design is very light in weight which is easily portable. The customer can properly properly market the product in both rural and urban areas and this impacts every part of the society positively. When it comes to product awareness, uh, we are going to conduct bike rallies, attend auto expo and trade shows. Also, we are going to spend good amount of money in digital marketing process for creating this awareness. Customers would know we exist by contacting hospitals on, because we will be in touch with ENT doctors and also hospitals. So, also through suppliers and social media because of advertising and events.